Hey, Comic Book Nation, BD here at New York Comic Con. I am here with Clark Gregg. You know him as Phil Coulson and Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Clark, we're coming up on 100 episodes with Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. I've got to ask, you know, first of all, how does that feel for you before we talk about what might be planned for it? How does it feel for you to get to this milestone? It's kind of incredible. I marvel at it every day. I, my daughter wanted to watch the original Iron Man the other day, and I, was, I hadn't seen it in a while. And first of all, it's really good. And second of all, I just seeing the, the little moments that they just started, decided to start adding for, for Phil oh, hey. Coulson hey. that I would someday end up with rambunctious co-stars like, like uh, young Chloe Bennett here uh, and a hundred missions into the future. Yeah. Uh, that we would spend. So I guess you both can kind of, and joining us now, Chloe Bennett, you know her as yeah. Sky, so Sorry, walking Chloe. into the interview Daisy. here. <laughs> Daisy, Daisy Johnson. Daisy uh, Poots. Quake. Quake. So uh, he, I guess you both can answer this. Uh, what, what kind of stuff do you think uh, you can tease that is planned for 100 episodes? Is there any kind of callbacks to earlier moments in the series that fans will catch, anything like that? Or is there the big... episode is actually us just watching Netflix. It's the whole team. It's the whole team watching some of the other Marvel shows on Netflix yeah. and yeah. wishing that we could swear. <laughs> Yeah. Um, <laughs> that's exactly it. That's what we do on the 100th episode. We don't know episode. what the 100th episode yeah, is going to be. We're, we're on like 94 or 5 right Six. now. 96. Yeah. Cool. So I basically know what happens in most of 96. Yeah. Yes. Okay. I'll, next week I'll find out yeah. how it ends. Yes. Yeah. They keep secrets from us. Very cool. So we, we, you know, we haven't seen Ghost Rider in a while. He's a fan favorite. Everybody loves to talk about him. The last time you had a moment with Ghost Rider, there was a cool little friendly look. Uh, you know, the, the, the internet caught that. So I was wondering, you know, is there any plans to bring Ghost Rider back? And for you, there was Ghost Rider kind of hinted at a dark secret. Anything we could hear about that? Oh, that Ghost Rider. <laughs> God, we Doesn't he just Gabriel play with these emotions? Some of the story that we're telling right at the beginning of this year sort of precludes the possibility of, uh, of Ghost Rider being around so far, but he was a fan favorite and he was a cast favorite. Yeah. Uh, I, I, we love what our show did with him. We kind of felt like it was a version of Ghost Rider that the world had needed. And... Um, I love the Robbie Reyes of it all too. That that was the, ver the version they went. I would East be. East LA was such a character at the beginning of last yeah. season. It was really, and I know that resonated with a lot of people. And um, he did such a good job um, playing. So maybe he, maybe he will come back. Maybe they, we legitimately don't know is right. the fun part about that. Yeah, this. but I'd be surprised if you didn't see him back on our show yeah. at some point. Yeah. Right now, towards the end of last season, we kind of got a tease of a mysterious group coming. A lot of people are speculating it might be Sword. I don't know if you guys can rule that in or rule that out yet. Uh, what can you say about this new group that's coming up? Um, you see us at a diner, you see a mysterious people show up, yeah. and then you see uh, Agent Phil Coulson in uh, the dorm room from Hell in Space. That's about all we know, other than it looks like there's going to be a... Uh, there's going to be some space adventures some space. in our future. Some more, everyone loves low yeah. as in Marvel Cinematic Universe. Yeah, I don't know that we have the rights to S.W.O.R.D., Okay. But, you know, we don't have the rights to a lot of things, and suddenly you see happen. a version of them that's a little <laughs> different. Um, you know, there's, there might be some, the Blue Man Group. Hey. Some very on. large, the Blue Man <laughs> Group, and by that I mean some, some Cree might be in our future. Yeah, there we go. Oh, no. we, we, I, well, that's wow, kind of that was a... The, uh, the crew are going to be so heavily I tied to... I can't say that out loud. I get nervous. <laughs> I'm scared right now. The, but we're uh, allowed to say it. We so. know the crew are going to be so heavily tied to Captain Marvel. It seems you guys are getting a little cosmic with Marvel Cinematic Universe getting a little cosmic. Oh, yeah. And Clark, you know, you were such a huge part of the first Avengers film. You helped launch the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Any chance we see it pop up with the Avengers in Infinity War? Uh, I mean, I guess there's always a chance, but uh, I would be the last one they would tell about that. It would be a midnight actual guys in black suits showing up at my house to get me. <laughs>